name is Pedro, and I've been at Chongqing University entering my fourth year, this coming this September. I'm the senior teacher here at the School of Foreign Languages and Cultures. I would like to speak to you about two important parts. First, Chongqing University and the School of Foreign Languages and Cultures, and secondly, the students themselves because that's the reason why we are here, and why I'm here, and hopefully you will be here too. First, about the university. The university was founded in 1929. It is the fourth largest university in China, at present at 55,000 students. 14,000 of those students are freshmen and sophomores, and they are located on Campus D, and you will have the privilege to teach here at Campus D. In addition to that, Chongqing University is ranked 28th out of 2,236 universities. Since, since it is in the top 30 schools, the students at this university are excellent. They're highly motivated. They're quite talented. And their abilities in English are also quite good as compared with other universities in China. These students represent the 55 different minorities in China, ranging from the Hans which are the majority, to the Mongols, to the Hui, to the Tibetans, and so on. So given this diversity in the classroom, with that also comes the challenge. The challenge of teaching them will challenge you as it has challenged me. And that's the reason I am here. In addition to the students themselves, the students are basically, most of them are engineers. Why? Because China, the School of Mechanical Engineering and the School of Electrical Engineering ranked fourth and fifth in the nation. The School of Architectural Design ranks number one. Yes, of course, we have other majors. Everything from journalism, to physics, to nuclear science, environmental studies. We have graduates here also, ranging from the masters to PhDs. But your challenge will be to work with the freshmen and sophomore during the freshman and sophomore year. And that in itself is a challenge because you and I will be preparing these students for the future. And I look forward to welcome you to Chongqing University, the city of Chongqing, and in China. This has been a challenge. I hope that the position itself is a challenge for you as it has been for me, and that it's as rewarding for you as it has been rewarded for me. Thank you very much.